We begin tonight with some disappointing news. The federal government denied Panama City's request for FEMA funding to replace the Marina Civic Center. The building was damaged heavily during Hurricane Michael, but apparently not heavily enough. As News 13's Jenna Maddox tells us, city officials are trying to decide their next move. For more than three years, Panama City officials have argued Hurricane Michael damaged the Civic Center beyond repair. They'd hoped the Federal Emergency Management Agency would pay to replace the entire facility. Tuesday, they learned the outcome of the battle. Through our demand for arbitration that the city did not prevail and did not win our argument with FEMA with regard to arbitration. This is discouraging news uh, because clearly the city of Panama City is struggling to get back up on its feet. The U.S. Civilian Board of Contract Appeals conducted the arbitration hearing in April. Three judges presided, two of them favored FEMA. It all came down to the HVAC system of the Civic Center. Was the central question, was it damaged because of Hurricane Michael? We contend that it was. The two judges said we didn't prevail in showing definitively that it was damaged because of Hurricane Michael. The city presented engineering inspections and results of a test recreating the Category 5 hurricane. And there was this video taken by an Orlando reporter who sheltered in the Civic Center during the storm. There's a lot of damage here. All the engineers based their professional opinions and even was corroborated by a FEMA field inspector that the HVAC system was saturated and should be replaced. Despite the outcome, the third judge said the damages were evident. He even noted that FEMA's only site inspector to assess mechanical systems agreed that we had to remove and replace uh, the HVAC system because of the hurricane and the wind driven rain. McQueen says the city will not appeal and is moving forward with plans to build a new performing arts and events center. The city has already hired an architectural firm to create plans. They plan to present conceptual designs in August. McQueen says they're looking for other funding sources. This obviously uh, puts a wrinkle into how we were thinking we would be able to do it. But we're going to be able to get there. We're going to have to work harder. We're going to have to find other ways of funding uh, to be able to support the effort that we have, which is to rebuild and build back a performing arts and events center that meets the needs of the community. In Panama City, Jenna Maddox, News 13, Panhandle Strong. McQueen did not say what the plans are for the old Civic Center building. The city is hosting a public meeting about the future performing arts and events center on July the 28th at 530 p.m. It'll be held at the Panama City Center for the Arts.